Hello folks, this is Bill at Bill Reddick Outdoors. Man, did I bite off more than I could chew. Uh, since I had this stroke, I needed some for therapy, so I decided I'd plant a garden this year. And it's more than I can handle. It's about to get the best of me. I need to get out there again. I done been out there this morning, but I need to get out there and tinker some more. I got to gather me up a few tools. But the most important tool of all is this little drill right here. Because I do me a little bit of work and a whole lot of sitting and resting. I told you, I do a little work and a whole lot of sitting and resting. It's about time to sit and rest. <laughs> Boy, this thing comes in handy, I ain't joking. I might have put this garden spot just a little bit closer to the house. <laughs> That's a long ways for me. You know what time it is now? You guessed it. Oh. <laughs> this chair here has become my best buddy. <laughs> when I started this project, I, I told y'all in the video before that I had had all kind of trouble with crows eating the kernels of corn. As soon as they'd sprout up about yay high, they'd come by and pick them up out of the ground and eat them, just burnt my corn for the last two or three years. And so somebody told me to put a stake at each corner and run a string across it in the shape of an X. And I did that and I took some pieces of tinfoil and I hung them on that string so the wind would blow them. And I asked if anybody else had some ideas and, and people were nice and commented several different things. Uh, but one thing that somebody said that I decided to try also, they said, put some chimes up out there. And I thought, my goodness, I, that, that'll only work if the winds blow it. But I put some, a little old set of chimes up and I was going, run me a long extension cord and put me a fan on there to blow it so it would chime all the time. But the good Lord took care of me. And you know, I had a breeze almost all day long for the whole time it took for that corn to sprout up and, and get big enough where the crows won't mess with it. Y'all had asked uh, to let you know how it did. I think the little string trick and the chimes did pretty good. And so, they put some chimes out here too. It gives it a little noise effect. So far it's working. Sometimes, that old chair is just not enough. Uh. And you have to get a little proper resting done. <laughs> Gardening at its finest. Huh. I didn't think about how I'm gonna get up from here. <laughs> that might be a problem. And you think your gardening is hard. <laughs> but I tell you, God's been awfully good to me. And just remember folks, whether you at work or play, I hope you have a nice day. This is Bill Reddick, Outdoors. See y'all.